One question for polyglot scammer guy. So you ask me if there's no other people who can speak a language. Of course, there are many people in the world who can speak other language. There are millions of people. There are millions of people in the world who can speak more than one language. But when polyglot YouTubers make some fake edited videos saying they can speak 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language and making some bullshit fake edited videos pretending to speak 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language, that's bullshit. And what is more bullshit is when they lie to people and after that they want to sell some ebooks and want to make some coaching how to learn a language even if they can only speak one or two language they want to pretend that they can speak 10 or 20 or 30 language there's a big difference between you can speak one language or two language or three language or even if there are some who can speak four language there's a big difference from that and saying that you can speak 30 language or 50 language and I will show you here, I think this one is the only honest video you have here. This is the only honest video and the only honest guy, but I will not say he is 100% honest. This Water Cordovina video I think is the most honest video. Because I do believe Water Cordovina can speak some languages. I do believe that he can speak Dutch if it's... I think he is really from Netherlands, like he says, so if so, then I believe Wouter Cordoena can speak Dutch, and I also believe he's fluent in English, even if he say that he's not perfect in English, but also me, I'm not perfect in English. If you're not a native speaker from an English country, then it's normal if you're not fluent in English or 100% in English, but still... I think he is fluent or high level in English, so I think Wouter Cordovina can speak good in English, that's my opinion. What I mean is that he don't need to be perfect in English to be fluent in English. I believe Wouter Cordovina is fluent, fluent in English, so I would say Wouter Cordovina, he is fluent in Dutch and fluent in English. And I think he knows some German, I'm not sure how much, but I do think he can speak German. And I do think that he can speak also French, but I'm not sure how much French. So that's already four languages. But I would say he's only fluent in two languages. He's fluent in English and Dutch. And then after that, maybe he can speak German and French. And after that, I'm not sure, but maybe he knows some Portuguese and maybe he knows some Spanish and I'm not sure if he knows some Russian or some other language. But I would say that Wouter Cordovina is the only one that I believe can speak some language or that I have seen he can speak some language. But when he makes some videos saying he can speak 29 language or 30 language, that's bullshit. And also when he makes some videos with some teenagers, when he makes some videos with some teenagers speaking 20 or 21 language or 17 language, that's also bullshit. And, and also he's not honest about the other polyglot. Like he will make videos with Richard Simcott. He will, he don't, why he don't say that Richard Simcott cannot speak 50 language? If he is 100% honest, he would say Richard Simcott cannot speak 50 language or more than, more than 50 language. He would say the other polyglot YouTubers are, cannot speak all those language they pretend to speak. But I would still say he is the most honest, but he is not 100% honest. Also, more, also, he showed his real talent or mistakes, like in his videos. He do mistakes when he makes some videos, he do mistakes in his videos when he speak. People can see his mistakes, that he do mistakes. Not same like some other polyglot, they want to make some fake edited videos that they want to sound 100% perfect. 
So what I think is this is one of the most honest videos and Wuta Kordwin is one of the most honest. But it doesn't mean that he's 100% honest. Because when he makes some bullshit videos speaking 29 language or 30 language, or he say he can speak 29 or 30 language, and when he make videos with some people saying that they're speaking 20 language or 21 language, that's also bullshit. Those videos where he make videos with someone who's like teenager, and I think you know what videos I mean, like two teenagers, a guy and a girl, and he say that they can speak 17 language or like 20 or 21 language. That's like bullshit. And also he's not honest about the other polyglot YouTubers. Like he should say that they're fake and then you will tell me why should he say that. Okay, then why should I also answer your question? You ask, you ask me to answer your question if there's other people who can speak a language. Then why you don't answer my question also? Do you think Luca Lampariello can speak 15 language? And if you say yes, then you are lying. Do you think Lindy Bosch can speak 12 or 13 language? You, lang language come up. You ask me some questions, now I ask you some question. Do you think Luca Lamparello can speak 15 language? Do you think Lindy Bosch can speak 12 or 13 language? Do you think Richard Simcott can speak 50 language or more than 50 language? Do you think Lina Vasquez can speak? I don't know how many languages she says she can speak. Do you think Lina Vasquez can speak all the languages she says she can speak? Do you think all those polyglot YouTubers can speak all the language that they say they can speak? And if you say yes, then you're lying to me. So, I will say the only one I think who can actually speak some language and who's not totally lying is Wuta Corduina, but still he's not totally honest also. And maybe there are some other polyglot who can speak more than one language. But when I say they can only speak one language, then I mean they're only fluent in, the, in that one language. When I say they can only speak English or they can only speak one language, then I mean they're only fluent in that one language. Maybe not they know some other language, but just few beginner stuff or something like that. But they will pretend that they are high level or fluent in 10 or 20 language. They will make some videos. They will make some fake edited videos pretending they're fluent and high level in 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language. Also, Wuta Corduina have this video with this guy speaking 65 language. You have this video with a guy speaking 65 language, this American guy. Do you think that guy can speak 65 language? You make some bullshit videos pretending that you are fluent or high level in 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language or 65 language you're making some bullshit videos if you want people to respect what you're doing if you want people to respect the polyglot youtubers then they should tell the truth about how many language they can speak and how good they can speak each language they should not be lying about it don't make some videos pretending that you're fluent in 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 or 65 language then you should tell the truth how good you can speak every language. Everyone should tell the truth how good they can speak every language. Same like Wuta Corduina. He's telling the truth or almost the truth. He will say that he can speak five or six language. And he will say that he's not 100% good in every language. But the other polyglot YouTubers, they will say that they are fluent in 10 or 12 or 20 or 30 or 50 language. Maybe they should do same like Wuta Corduina and tell the tr tell how good they can speak every language. And they should not sell some coaching or language learning course. And pr they should not pretend that they can speak 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language just so they can sell some course or so they can sell some ebooks. You're not being honest and then you want people to respect what you're doing. You're lying to people then you want people to respect what you're doing. But in my opinion, I think Wuta Corduina is the most honest between all of you liars. Between all of you liars, Wuta Corduina is the most honest, but he's not 100% honest, but he's the most honest. Except of that, most of you are bullshit. Maybe Steve Kaufman can speak some language, 
but he's not fluent or high level in eight, 18 or 20 language. Steve Kaufman is not fluent in 20 language. Most of the language he just speak few beginner stuff or or something like that. And Luca Lampraello, I have watched his videos and they're totally fake. Even if he knows something in different language, maybe few beginner stuff. And Lindy Boats, she's totally fake. Lindy Boats is totally fake. Most of the polyglot YouTubers are totally fake. And they pretend that they are very, very high level in 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language, even if they can only say few sentences. And even if they just make some fake edited videos, you want to ask me questions, then you should also be honest first. Don't come and ask me question when you are when all of you polyglot YouTubers are lying to people. You lying to people, then you come and want to ask me questions. And I was not really going to answer your video anymore because I'm tired of you. I'm not going to waste my time. I'm not going to waste my time that one day you will make a video then next day i will respond you with a video the next day you will respond me with a video the next day i respond you with a video i'm not going to waste my time to respond every video you make so from now on i'm not sure if you make some video asking me something or whatever i might not respond to you i don't want to waste my time on this i'm going to show in my videos what i think and what i believe then people can think or believe what they want I will show in my videos what I think about those polyglot YouTubers. Then it's up to people to see them and then they can think or believe what they want. If they want to believe you that you can speak 10 or 30 or 50 language or that you're fluent in 50 language, then people can do that. If they want to see my videos and see how much fake you are and want to believe that, then they can believe that. It's up to people what to believe. I will show what I think. I will show what I think in my videos, then it's up to people to believe what they want. But I will say Wuta Cordovina is the most honest of you, even if he's lying and not 100% honest, but he's still the most honest one of you. Wuta Cordovina is not 100% honest, but he's the most honest of you, especially when it comes to say how much he can speak a language. When it comes to how much he can speak a language, he's the most honest of you, He's almost telling the truth. He's telling the truth or almost the truth. He say that he is fluent in Dutch and that he say that he's not fluent in English. But I will, I will, I will see. I will be nice. I will be nice. Even Wouter Cordovina say he's not fluent in English. I will say Wouter Cordovina is fluent in English and very good in English. But then I will say he's German and French. Maybe it's not high level but he can speak German and French maybe maybe he can speak some Portuguese or some Spanish and I don't know if he can speak a little Russian or a little from some other language also I will say Wouter Cordovina is the most honest about himself I will say Wouter Cordovina is the most honest about himself how much he can speak every language he's the most honest to tell how much he can speak every language when it comes to himself but he's not honest about the other polyglot YouTubers. He's not honest about the other polyglot YouTubers because he will make videos with other polyglot YouTubers speaking 17 language or 20 language or 21 language or, or 30 language or 65 language or something like that. He will pretend, he will pretend that the other polyglot YouTubers can speak many language that they cannot speak. Even those, those kids, those teenagers, those teenagers who cannot speak all those language, he will make videos with them and say they can speak 17 language or 20 language or 21 language. Even those teenagers, for sure, they cannot speak those language. And also that guy saying that he, that American guy say he can speak 65 language. Who have a video with Wouter Cordovina? That's bullshit. So he's not 100% honest, but he's honest about his himself. All like. Of course, the videos where he say he speak 29 language or 30 language or 21 language, that's bullshit. But in this video, he's honest. And also in some other video, he say that he cannot speak all those language fluently. I will not say he's 100% honest, but he's the most honest of you. Wouter Cordovina is not 100% honest, but he's the most honest of you fake people.
also Wuta Cordoina I don't think that he sells some ebooks or some bullshit like that so that's also one good thing about him I don't think he's selling some ebooks I'm not sure but I don't think he sells some ebooks and same time I don't think he have this kind of coaching like the other polyglot tutubers but I'm not 100% sure but I don't think he have this kind of coaching thing and same time I want to say about his he has some membership to his channel but I don't have problem with that if he's being if he will be 100% honest then I don't have a problem that he have some membership to his channel because the membership to his channel that's his own private thing that's his own private thing if he want people to pay some membership to watch some different videos like that so if you want to do that I don't have a problem with that if you have some membership that people may pay membership to his channel or some patreon like that because it's something that he make if you want people to pay for some extra things to watch some extra videos or some extra things it's okay so I don't think he's doing something wrong when it comes to making his money when it comes to making his money he's not doing something wrong only wrong thing is that he is when you say that he can speak 29 language and I know that he will say that he can in this video he's being honest but he's not being honest all the time in all his videos like I think it's okay this kind of videos he make he makes some prank some kind of prank videos or going out in the street and and speak to people in different language this kind is just is just some kind of entertainment video and there's no problem with that but I think he should say to people end of the video same like those people who make some prank videos he should tell people end of the video when he speak to people he should tell them if you talk to them in Swedish or or Italian or some other language or Tagalog or whatever language who should, he should tell those people we talk with in the video end of the video he should tell them he should tell them okay I can only speak a little bit of of this language I'll just practice only and I just do this video just for fun and entertainment like that and he should tell that to people who's watching his videos he should say to them I cannot speak 100% Swedish or I cannot speak 100% this language this video is just some kind of fun entertainment video so he should be 100% honest he is honest in some videos but not 100% he should be even more honest about how much he can speak same like he do in this video with you same like he's doing in this video with you he should do more of this kind of videos on his channel on his own channel he should do more of this kind of videos telling people how much he can speak every language he should be more honest about that if he do like that and if he concentrate on himself he should concentrate on himself he should he should forget this whole language learning community if you want to communicate with people from the language learning community it's okay he communicate with them he sent message with with you text you on Facebook or Instagram or or Twitter or WhatsApp it's okay he have communication with you people but the kind of communication I'm talking about is when he makes some YouTube videos speaking 20 language or 30 language or 17 language or something like that this kind of videos where he's where he they make some videos together speaking 17 language or 20 language or 30 language this way he make it look like those other people he make videos with can speak all those language when he make some video with some kid some teenager speaking 20 language or 21 language or 17 language then he make it look like this teenager can speak 17 language or 20 or 21 language when he make videos that guy speaking 65 language then it's then he make it look like okay this guy can speak 65 language so I don't think he should make this kind of videos but I'm just saying my opinion but I know you don't really care about my opinion if you did care about my opinion then you would not do this kind of bullshit if you did care about honesty if you did care about honesty then you would be honest from the start you will not wait for someone to tell you to be honest if you did care about honesty 
You polyglot YouTubers, if you did care about honesty, you will not wait for people to ask you to be honest. You will be honest from the start. But if Wuta Corduina want to be 100% honest and not be same like the other polyglot, I think he should work for himself. He should work for himself by making his own kind of entertainment channel. He has some entertaining videos, some funny entertaining videos that he go out and speak with people in different language. It's okay he do that. It's okay he go out even if you go out and speak with people in 30 different language. If you make some video, he go out speak with someone in Russian. Another video, he speak with someone on the, or some people on the street in German. Some other video, go out on the street speaking with people in French. Some other video, he go out speak with people on the street in Portuguese. It's okay he do this kind of videos as long as he tell people on his YouTube channel how good he can speak every language and being honest about how good he can speak every language but he should not pretend that he can speak 29 or 30 language but in this video you make here with him he's telling the truth or almost the truth about how good he can speak the language but I'm not going to repeat it again I already I think you get what I mean but I think Uta Corduina might be one of the most honest polyglot YouTubers even he's not 100% honest but he's one of the most honest of you fake people and Richard Simcott when I say Richard Simcott is only fluent in English or can only speak one language that's my opinion because I have all, only seen proof that he can speak English as a, as a language that he's fluent in maybe Richard Simcott knows something in French or Portuguese or maybe he knows something in Russian or some other language but he's, I don't think he's fluent in this language I did not see any proof that Richard Simcott is fluent in other language than English maybe he knows some other language but I don't think he's fluent but Richard Simcott saying he can speak 50 language that's a bullshit when Richard Simcott say he can speak 50 language, that's bullshit. And most of the polyglot YouTubers, they're lying about how many language they can speak and how good they can speak the language. They should be honest about how many language they can speak and how good they can speak every language. And same time, they should not sell some ebooks in language they cannot speak or, or they should not make some lie about speaking 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language just so people will buy their ebooks. The reason people buy their ebooks is because they say they can speak 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language. Then people want to buy their ebooks. That's the reason. They should be honest about how many languages they can speak and how good they can speak this language. And also doing this coaching session thing is some bullshit. But that's my opinion. And you can have your opinion, but this is my opinion. So that's it. And if you want to answer some question for me, then you can tell me how, how many languages you think the other polyglot YouTubers can speak and how good they can speak this language. And you can be honest about that. But there's a very big chance that you will lie about it. There's a very big chance that you will lie and say that Luca Lampraello can speak 15 languages. There's a very big chance that you will lie and say that Lindy Boots can speak 12 or 13 languages. There's a very big chance that you will lie about how many languages the other polyglot YouTubers can speak. So that's it and I'm not going to waste more time on this bullshit. I want to use my time to make some other kind of videos. I'm not going to waste my time to make some drama responding each other every day. I don't want to make waste my time making drama that me and you need to respond each other, other every day. I'm, I did not make my YouTube channel so I can make some video response to you every day or something like that. You know what? Now I have watched the whole video. And if you think I'm not a nice guy or something, look, I will give a like to this video. I will like this video because I do think and believe that Wouter Corduina can speak some languages, maybe not high level. But I do believe that he is fluent in Dutch, maybe. I think he's fluent in Dutch and then fluent in English. And he knows some German and knows some French. And I think also he knows some Portuguese and Spanish. Maybe he knows a little Russian. 
and I'm not sure about the other language. Maybe the other language you know a little bit or just memorize few stuff. So I make a like to this video, but this is the only video I'll give you a like. If you want to do something good, language come up. If you want to do something good, make more of this kind of videos. But with other polyglot YouTubers also. But I think there's a big chance that the other polyglot YouTubers will not be honest. If you want to make something good with your channel, make more of this kind of videos where you make some honest interview with every polyglot YouTuber about how many languages they can speak and how much they can speak every language but honest videos but there's a big chance the other polyglot youtubers will not do it and there's also a big chance if the other polyglot youtubers make a video with you and saying that they're being honest there's a big chance that they will not be honest because i think many of them cannot speak many language the reason water cordoina is honest is actually because he can speak some language because Uther Cordovina can actually speak two languages fluently and he know another four language or five language that he know something for four or five more language and maybe he knows some beginner stuff in few more language so Uther Cordovina does know many language so that's the reason why he want to be honest but maybe not the only reason maybe he is just more honest person than the other maybe he's more honest than the other polyglot youtubers and same time because he do know some language but I don't think someone like Lindy Boats will be honest because there's because she can only speak one language and if she knows something from other language then it's very very little so I don't think Lindy Boats will make an honest video with you if she make a video with you I think she will lie about how good she can speak the language and same with Cool Langs or, or Luca Lampriello or some other polyglot and Lina Vasquez, I think most of those polyglot YouTubers, you cannot make an honest video with them because they're not going to tell the truth because those people, they cannot speak all the language they say they can speak. But this is just an idea. This is just an idea and an opinion. If you can make more or more of this kind of videos with other polyglot YouTubers that they tell the truth about how many languages they can speak then I think you have something good to make but I will still continue making my videos and showing how fake they are I know you don't like that I know you don't like that but since most of the polyglot youtubers on youtube they're lying about how many languages they can speak and how good they can speak the lang this language then I will keep making videos showing how fake they are even if you don't like it but that's what I'm going to do but I will say that Uther Cordovina can speak some language even if he's not honest about the other people he's not honest about the other people how much they can speak the language and then you will tell me why he should be honest if he make videos with them then he should be honest or else he should not make videos with them but let's forget that and about you I will tell you what I think maybe you know some Spanish maybe you know a little bit Russian but you're not being honest about how much you can speak them but also it doesn't matter it's only two more language than English but I'm just saying my opinion I don't think you are high level in Spanish or fluent in Spanish maybe you do know some Spanish and Russian maybe you're just beginner in Russian but also it doesn't really matter my channel is not really about you who say you can speak two or three language my channel is not about you language come up you people who say they can speak one or two or three language or even four language my channel is a, mostly about people who say they can speak 10 or 20 or 30 or 50, 50 or many language so even if you can speak one or two or three language i don't really care language come up even if you can speak one or two or three language or even if you can speak four language i don't care but those people who make some videos saying they can speak 10 or 12 or 15 or 30 or 50 language that's bullshit and they don't even prove it so that's it and good luck with your channel language come up good luck with your channel but try to make it an honest channel try to make your channel an honest channel good luck with your channel
One last thing, what do you think about this 65 language, Americans speak 65 language, or that Exalmnik learn a language in 12 hours or 24 hours. Exalmnik saying he learned a language in 12 hours or 24 hours, and that he learned 15 language in one year. What do you think about this Exalmnik, that he said that he can learn any language in one day or in 12 hours or something like that? And what do you think about people like Ikena or other polyglot or cool langs like that? What do you think about them? They can speak all the language they say they can speak. And about you, I don't know how much you can speak every language, but it also doesn't matter. It's only three language. Maybe you know a little Spanish or a little Russian, but I don't believe that you're high level or something like that also doesn't matter. But the other polyglot YouTubers, they are fake. Most of them cannot speak all those language they say they can speak. They're not being honest. That's the problem. They lie and say they're high level in 10 or 20 or 30 or 50 language, even they're not.